What's up, hope you guys are doing well. So today we're going to go over a combat demo by the game Ascenders, which is on the Avalanche blockchain. And they recently got a bunch of well-received funding from big investors, which popped up my radar. And they had a very unique campaign where it was an invite-only Discord. However, I think near the end they didn't have that much people, so they started just inviting everyone. So I'm very curious to see how this community turns out as they already have a demo. And this is my second time going through it, so hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let's get to it. Let's see over here, it's a little bit buggy. You have to click at different places for it to work. Alright, let's go. Let's smash some bugs. Let's go. Where do you have? Smash them, yes. It's a more simple demo, but... I like how they have actual gameplay ready, and this is on the third highest quality graphics. Let's smash this. Alright. Very fun. It reminds me of the games I played them like a few years ago. Like those like RPG games. Probably towards the top. I like how you like change the different angles too. So like move it up and down and stuff. Let's click that. So it looks like I gotta try to collect as many of the orange ones as possible since they seem to be the rarest. Oh, boss for you. Let's see if we can find a boss. I've only seen like two types of them, different color. One of the most fun one, fun ones I've tried in my NT game. I like how you just like, smash it, and just like have fun with it. Oh, he popped out of nowhere. Like, And the cool thing is, I think you, um, for the top 100 players, you get an airdrop of the tokens too. So if you're really into the game and you want to maximize like the potential, who knows, that token could like 100x or something. And then you would have made like $10,000, $50,000 from just like becoming one of the top 100 scorers. And I think the combat is, um, this one's for another month. For people to compete in, which is super cool. Oh damn, I already got two minutes left. Let's see what we can do. So it could be like a little fun challenge if you have like a guild and you guys like try to figure out like the best way to make the most. Spot, let's go. So, very entertaining game or trial where you can just like smash it. Is this a new area? Let's see. I low key might be going backwards, I'm not even sure. Let's see. 
a lot of glitchy stuff. The game has a lot of bugs, or this demo has, but lots of potential. I guess to make the uh, get the most points, you just smash it and then try to like sprint towards it to get it. Let's see if I can kill this before the timer's over. Oh, finished the rival zone. Oh, nice. Okay, I proved the score right now. Right? I like that. Uh, I am seven hundred place. Wow, that's crazy. Maybe there's like a, another way to like figure out how to do it. And I like how you have the options to like tweet your score and everything. You get to play again and again. It can become a big thing. Let's get back to the main menu. I'll try to show you guys what they have. Get the leaderboards, different options, ascenders, GG. I'm not sure what that means. Oh, it's the website. Okay, pretty cool. So, I'll show you guys the website. So, center side GG. Enjoy the combat challenge. One million GC prize pool. Very big. You get to mail address. You got your investors. Three arrows capital. They're very big. Merit Circle. Blizzard. E Fiance. Guild Fight. Avocado Guild. Fire Sword. There's just a bunch of really big people. And let's check out their YouTube, let's see if it's good or not. Okay, not that active on YouTube, so they're very brand new for sure. So, 6 million in funding, so very solid. That's like above average so far. And yeah, that's about it. Uh, I'll leave the Discord link in the caption along with other links like uh, the light paper and all the other social media. So let me know what you guys think of this. I'm very excited that right now there's a bunch of games that are releasing these demos first to attract a big audience and to cultivate them with these fun challenges. And then they release their tokens. So I find that very cool. So a lot of these newer companies with better teams that have more funding, that are, are better at cultivating communities, that are coming from these more traditional gaming backgrounds. They're coming into this and maybe they're, they have experience from previous blockchain games that fail too. So they're rebuilding these games that are higher quality with even more funding and just more experience overall. So very cool and yeah, can't wait to see how this one goes. So talk to y'all next time.